and I'm obsessed with Apple Lounges. Ooh. But I am very impulsive. So I'm overlooking Union Square right now. Welcome back to a new vlog, kicking this off on a Friday morning. If you saw my last vlog, that spanned like a month. Time got away from me, but I'm determined for this vlog to be just a few days, vlogging a bit more in depth. I just made my to-do list for today. It's gonna be a bit of a busy day. I need to, right after this, I'm gonna go get ready. I need to film a Fatletics TikTok, some stories. I need to film a q and I wanna try to film decorating my house for Christmas, which I put up my tree, which is right here. Different location this year, right by the window. Kind of liking it. Earlier this week, it was just cozy and raining and Giselle and I decided to put the tree up really early. It felt right. So I'm gonna film a video decorating my house for Christmas. We'll see what I get done of that today and I need to run some errands. So busy day it's gonna be. If you saw my last vlog, I also talked about how I've been going to physical therapy. It's been like a month of that now and I am finally cleared from all my knee problems to be going back to rumble workouts, which is so exciting because those are my favorite. So hopefully if I have time, I wanna go to one of those tonight. And then tomorrow, Giselle and I are going to San Francisco just from like a Saturday to Monday for a short little trip. I think there's already like the ice skating and Christmas, big Christmas tree in Union Square there. And yeah, I've been to San Francisco a couple times, but I had a Delta Companion flight ticket that was gonna expire at the end of the year. So we were like, well, we should just go somewhere because it's a free flight. So anyways, so that's gonna be the weekend. I'm gonna go get ready. Welcome to the vlog. And I think it's gonna be a great next few days. Also, in case you missed it, I finally posted my video breaking down what I spent on my summer Europe trip. It is a long video as you can see. I tried to make it fun to watch. I included like clips of absolutely everything that we did that I'm talking about throughout the video. And I'm just breaking down like literally every single cost. So I'll have that link in case you missed it. All right, it is a little bit later. Just shot my Fabletics content. This is also my first time opening it. Like I pick it out every month, but I hadn't tried any of it on yet. And I'm obsessed with it. It's like a PJ set. And then this robe, I have another outfit that the robe matches, but I just put it back on because it's so comfy. These like waffle knit robes. This video is not sponsored by Fabletics. I will have these linked below. I feel like these will be such good like gifts for the holidays. So I got a couple of different robes, which I don't think they've ever had. And I'm obsessed, so now I'm cozy. <laughs> so I'm gonna edit this together and then film my q and A. I I need to pull the questions from that. I'm crossing my fingers, <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Friday is when the yard work people come or the townhouses I live in. And I don't know, I feel like maybe I should hurry up and film the Q&A now in case they get here. But also they could just get here anytime, so it really doesn't matter if I film an hour later. So anyways, I'm rambling, gonna edit this and hope that I can film this Q&A with no issues later. All right, I now just finished my Q&A. That I think is gonna go on my main channel this weekend. It's Friday now, that'll be Sunday, so it'll be up. By the time this video goes up, I'm answering some juicy questions in it about if we are living together, if I'm gonna live in LA forever, just things you might not expect you can watch in that video. I still have a couple other things I need to do today. I'm mostly done. Um, I need to plan out this just got sent over, which is very exciting because I already have the big one of these but I'm doing something with Therabody for the mini for like some a travel TikTok, which is fitting in perfectly to San Francisco this weekend because that's the only trip I'm actually going on through the holidays. So I got this. That would be very cool. Also another cool, or I guess this was like just a PR thing I got recently. Oh my God, I literally almost just knocked my hand off my stove that I should probably wash from this morning. This area of my counter is overflowing with sweets right now. I've left over Halloween candy, but these are huge. This company, Last Crumb Cookies, sent me like a pack of 12 cookies. Each one is like, I mean, they're like trendy names and whatever, but like they're each a different flavor. We've eaten two so far. They are the best cookies I've ever had in my entire life. 
entire life. I'm not even, I'm not kidding. And unfortunately they're very expensive, which fortunately, <laughs> I guess fortunately I did not pay for those, but I'm like, I wanna get these for my family because they would love them, but they're like $12 a cookie. But anyways, they are delicious and I think very worth it if you ever find yourself in a situation where you wanna try one of those. Wow, beautiful day. <laughs> Made it to a five o'clock rumble class. I'm surprised and tired. Dinner time. <laughs> After rumble, we went to Sephora. And now, one of my meal videos at one point, I showed how to make these delicious like teriyaki salmon bowls that are so good. But tonight we decided to try a different variation. This looks so ugly, but like all the ingredients are inside this little, what's this called, Giselle? Rice paper. Rice paper wraps. So just switching it up. We'll see how we like it. This is what it looks like before we wrap it up. We got cucumber, avocado, jalapeno, green onion, um, some little teriyaki seaweed things, and then the teriyaki salmon. Yum. I'm so excited. Giselle is struggling over here. They look good. Okay. So things I'll make sure I never have in a future home. These freaking push open doors. Saturday from the farmer's market. <laughs> I don't know what that is. I got like a brown sugar cinnamon latte. It's eight bucks. I'm really catering to the rich and famous <laughs> out here. So we decided to share. <laughs> Delta Lounge is cool. Can't <laughs> like watch the planes. Good morning from San Francisco. It is Sunday morning right now. Oh, you can hear the little trolley cable car. Giselle and I are in San Francisco. Our hotel, the view is so pretty. Like we got in last night when it was already dark and like we're staying at the Westin. I forget the rest of what it's called, but it's right on Union Square in San Francisco. And Giselle like grew up around here. She was saying, we were talking about coming here that her dream as a child or was just, or maybe not dream, maybe that's a stretch, <laughs> but that like when she would be out in Union Square where like the ice skating is and the big Christmas tree and whatever, and that she would always like imagine what it'd be like to stay at like this hotel, like with that being your view. So we booked one of the rooms overlooking Union Square and it is so, so pretty. Last night we, it was a struggle to stay awake. I've been waking up early these days, but like 6 a.m. But last night we had a very late reservation at this place we actually went to the last time we were in San Francisco called the Black Cat, which is like a supper club and like jazz bar type thing. So at 11 p.m. we were seated for that and it was just live jazz, very fun, really good drinks and we have the full day today. I think we're gonna go get some food here in a second. Maybe to this place I went like literally years ago the very first time i was in san francisco with taylor and shelby we went to this place called the grove and i only remember that because i associate it with like the name of something in la like the grove in la and i just remember they had the best blt sandwich like if you're in chapel hill my college town you know merits is like known for their blt it's like a famous place in my college town and this i remember was better so i really am just looking forward to hopefully having this again and then today or tomorrow we're gonna ice skate because basically tomorrow on monday our flight back is in the evening so we're gonna have to if we can't get late checkout then we're just gonna have to um store our bags and just like spend some time walking around out doing stuff in the city so today or tomorrow we're gonna ice skate i feel like it might be a little less busy tomorrow and i'm not a very good ice skater i don't think so I don't know we'll see it's just been a lovely little time it feels so Christmassy like the view here of all the buildings I'm like low-key getting like a New York vibe or something it's just a wonderful time
see if the BLT is as good as I remembered. <clears throat> by where Giselle used to work. What's it called? The uh, Interval. It's so cute. We got some steak tarts from morning from Monday in San Francisco. It is our final day here. It's like 9 a.m. right or close to 10 a.m. right now. We're gonna head out, get a quick breakfast, do some sightseeing. We really saved a lot accidentally for today. And I think we check out of our hotel at like two or three. So I'm overlooking Union Square right now. They're Zambonying the ice out here. That's about to open for ice skating. So we're gonna do that today in San Francisco. I've never taken the little trolley car. What's it called? Cable car. Cable car. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying that. Um, so I think we're gonna do that today. We're just gonna squeeze in as much as we can. Yesterday we walked into, oh, we need to do your Zara return and I need to go to Victoria's Secret. Ah! Yesterday Giselle wanted to walk into Aritzia um, cause it's like right beside where we're staying. I feel like I'm someone who doesn't like shop a lot, but I am very impulsive with like in-person shopping. Like we just walked in and I saw this coat and I thought, well, that's not the best thing I've ever seen, so I bought this coat. I don't have my wide angle camera, so this is a bit difficult to see at the moment, but I'll have this linked below. I also got a leather, like, long coat option. So now I am set for the winter and all the winters after that. Screen. <laughs> How cute is that? This is the most old school photo book. Okay, these are so cute. Back in LA, I've decorated for Christmas. So just a very quick outro clip to wrap up this vlog. It's such a good weekend in San Francisco. It was my third time going. It was by far like my favorite time being there. It was also my second time being there at Christmas. Some about this time. I just loved it. I want to go back, but that is it for this vlog. I'm going to pick up a new one starting in like five seconds. So that'll be coming soon. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next vlog. Bye.